Your children may have mentioned a method we use in school known as the jumping method. Today we're going to show you how to add a two digit number using that method. Each classroom in our school has a bead bar. The children are used to using these bead bars. The first thing we need to do when adding 46 and 33 is locating number 46 on the bead bar. We find 40 and count on six more to make 46. We'd mark that on the bead bar so the child knows where their starting number is. We talk a lot about place value of number. In order to add 33, the child needs to understand that 33 is made up of three tens and three units. We start by adding the three tens by counting on from our original number of 46. We've counted on 10 which gives us the number 56. Counting on from 56, we need to add another 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 becomes 66. Therefore, jump in another 10. Carrying on from that, we count another 10 places. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And that number becomes 76. Therefore, jump in another 10. We've now jumped 10, 20, 30. And so the 30 part of 33 is done. All that remains is to count three more units on from 76. 1, 2, 3 which therefore gives us the number 79, and we've jumped three places. When we check our work, we can see we've added together 10 and 10, making 20, another 10 making 30, and three more making 33. So the answer to our sum, 46 add 33 equals 79. We also use the jumping method when taken away from another number. The first thing you do is locate the lowest number. So with this one, we find 27 on our bead bar. We know where 20 is and we count up seven more. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That bead is bead number 27. We then count up to our nearest 10. To, to work out the difference between 27 and 30. So we do this by jumping. We jump from 27 to 30, which gives us a different of, difference of one, two, three beads. From there, this part of the sum becomes much more simple, providing the child can count in tens. We jump from 30 to 40, which gives us a jump of 10, from 40 to 50, giving us another jump of 10. From 50 to 60, from 60 to 70, and from 70 to 80. We have now jumped from our starting number to our highest number. When we add all these together, we can count to work out our final total number. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 and 3 more makes 53.